We are so late here. But I love these guys, and I want to hear them, because they've been so patient. All right, boss boss of the Vernon Hills Choir, identify yourself. Uh, my name is Jeremy Little. Nice to see you again. Thank you for having us. We we're loved delighted. having you guys in last year. Yeah, thank you. We were delighted to be here. And we're about to see if all the good, talented seniors graduated. <laughs> uh, all right, you got one for us here. <laughs> Thanks for that intro. That was helpful. <laughs> no, I love these guys. <laughs> Whenever you're ready. All so. right, this is Caroling Caroling by Alfred Burt. Caroling, caroling, now we go, Christmas bells are ringing. Caroling, caroling, through the snow, Christmas bells are ringing. Joyous voices, sweet and clear, sing the sad apart to cheer. Ding dong, ding dong, Christmas bells are ringing. Caroling, caroling, through the town, Christmas bells are ringing. Caroling, caroling, up and down, Christmas bells are ringing. Mark ye well the song we sing, glad some tidings now we bring. Ding dong, ding dong, Christmas bells are ringing. Caroling, caroling, near and far, Christmas bells are ringing. Following, following yonder star, Christmas bells are ringing. Sing we all this happy morn, lo, the King of Heaven is born. Ding dong, ding dong, Christmas bells are ringing. How about that? Wow. Isn't that beautiful? beautiful? Let's go with the coveted sitting ovation right out of the gate. Right? No it's very nice. You know what? We're so late now, let's get in trouble. You got another one? Let's do another one right here. What are you going to do? Sure. This next tune is called uh, Bring a Torch, Jeanette Isabella. It's one of three tunes that we uh, commissioned uh, our friend Paul Langford, who uh, is a nationally known composer and arranger, to do. And, um, so this is original? Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's, well, it's a, a French carol that he arranged in like a jazz way. Wow. Yeah. Cool. All right. Yeah. in the morning they did that. I know, that's fantastic. Imagine how good they'd be at 7 at night. <laughs> you guys, very, very nice. Very Thank nice. Thank you. Uh, can we get more in a little bit? Y we certainly can. Thank all you. All right. And uh, we're recording all of this. We'll sell it and give you none of the profit. <laughs> um, it's the Vernon Hills High School Choir for the holidays. More coming up. By the way, you guys are on TV. Wave to CLTV. TV. Oh, all right. Right. If you look right behind you there in the center. Oh, You're about to see yourself on TV. There you go. There you go. Um... Let's get to the news now. <laughs> Let's see Chicago's very own 720. WGN Chicago and WGNRadio.com. Thank you. Merry Christmas. See you tomorrow.
Uh, the Vernon Hills uh, High School Choir is here. Is there a specific name other than that I should address you with? They're the Chamber Choir. The Chamber Choir. Yeah. My apologies. <laughs> uh, where have they been performing? Uh, we've performed all over the community and at... Um, some uh, retirement homes and uh, local businesses, uh, elementary schools, and um, and here on the air. How many people? Uh, we have 25 total. Okay, and uh, it's a big deal to take an arrangement like the last one and get it together and make them sound so fabulous. How long does that take from start to finish? Well, we start working, we have about 25 tunes that we sing, and we start working in uh, August, and they sing them all memorized and in mixed formation, and there's foreign language ones. And Is that right? Yeah, yeah. So they, uh, they, they work very hard. We take a retreat to Wisconsin and go have fun and, and learn a lot of these, and uh, they're the, the top kids in school um, for singing and... And generally for everything else, I think, too. I said your, your two sopranos sounded, oh, so, your two yeah. sopranos sounded like angels. Oh, thank you. Song, right? thank you. Yeah, they really are tremendous. Uh, very, very impressive. Uh, you can do a few more here in a second, but um, um, uh, do you, when you, you know, you see these kids, especially the freshmen and the sophomores, who want to get to the front, <laughs> um, do you see folks that you go, wow, I'm blown away by this uh, youngster, mm -hmm. and uh, they're going to have to step up right now? Yeah, yeah. We have uh, we have four sophomores in the group, um, and they are uh, phenomenal, and, and it's hard to make it as a sophomore, and they, they have done it. Um, we, uh, we're a small school. I think we're only like 1,250, 1,300 students, mm -hmm. um, but uh, we have a, a lot of talent and a lot of really hard-working folks. Uh, well, I love Vernon school. Hills. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, it's, it's beautiful. Uh, you guys, by the way, better be nice to the sophomores. Is there a little hazing going on when you're not looking? <laughs> not, not that you know of. <laughs> <laughs> not that you know of. Yeah, it's... <laughs> All right, what are you going to do next? All right, this next tune is another one of the uh, carols uh, by Paul Langford. Uh, a beautiful uh, Gustav Holst, the composer, wrote the tune, and Christina Rossetti, the American poet, had the, um, the text. It's called In the Bleak Midwinter. Once again, the Vernon Hills Chamber Choir.
Uh, just tremendous. Uh, just amazing. And, and if you would, please identify your soloist there. Uh, that was Jillian Bowes. Jillian, oh, beautiful yeah. job. Yeah. Jillian Bowes. Yeah, really, really. Gorgeous. Thank you. Oh. I, I don't know how you do Another that. voice of an angel. <laughs> um, Andy Mazur's here for Dave. Were you in choir in school? Never. Can you sing now? I can't sing then. Then or now? Or now. Yeah. yeah. What about in the shower? Your car? Uh, the shower? The car? The car? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Come to Vernon Hills. We can teach you. Yeah. I, I have no audience in the car. That's an easy. That's an easy one. <laughs> Um, Patrick Kane's going to join us in about 20 minutes. We're going to ask you guys to stay, and we'll ask Kaner. Oh, it's next. I'm sorry. Patrick Kaner's going to join us next. We're going to ask you guys to stay, obviously. And uh, we would like Kaner to tell us his favorite Christmas song and then see if you guys can sing to Patrick Kane. Oh, yeah. There you go. Awesome. Kaner joins us next, and then more with the Vernon Hills Chamber Choir. Uh, 720 WGN and CLTV. I know you are. Believe me, I know. Uh, we got the Vernon Hills Chamber Choir here. They're all big Patrick Kane fans. Who had the the, the plate with Kaner's number on it? That's me. What's your name, dude? Kyle. Kyle's got a license plate, personalized Patrick Kane plate. Um, and all these. I think probably think it's me or something. <laughs> That's right. So drive safely. Um, and Jenny Williams is here. Jenny, say hi to Patrick Kane. Hi, you're my favorite player. <laughs> Okay, Hi, Jenny. How you doing? I know, Jenny. Jenny, pull it together now. Come on. <laughs> I'm, I'm so good. How are you? <laughs> I'm good. Are you guys having fun? Yes. <laughs> now, do you have any deeper questions than how are you? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yes. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. What's your question? Yeah. Um, what's your proudest moment? Oh, that's nice. Cock? That's nice. That's very good, Jenny. What is your proudest moment, Gina? Um, I don't know. That's a good question. That's much uh, better than the stuff I usually ask him. Well done, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> Je- Jenny sounds excited to be on your show, Steve. I think um, it has nothing to do with you, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> I think it has to be uh, pro- probably uh, scoring the overtime winning goal there in 2010. Yeah, how about that? Um, how about that? us win our first cup there and first in 49 years for the Blackhawks. So that was an amazing That moment. was pretty special. Yeah, it was something else. By the way, did we ever find out where that puck ended up? No, I don't think we did. I mean, there's there's some rumors out there, but uh, I don't think we found it. So we'll have to. You guys, you guys got to help us. We got to get on the hunt. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Jenny will find it. And, uh, I will. <laughs> and uh, Kana, we're gonna have the chamber choir come over and shovel your driveway out if it snows too hard because they're they're big fans. All right, Jenny, say Thank goodbye you, to your friend Patrick Kane. Thank you so much. Goodbye. Have a great day. Okay, bye, you too. Patrick. We got. Uh, uh, and Merry Christmas, my best of your whole family. Yeah, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Thanks for having me on, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. All right, and I'll tell Jenny all the best, too. Exactly. Well, there you go. All right, there you go. There you go. It's there Patrick you go. Kane. It's Patrick Kane. It's Jenny Williams' new best friend, Patrick Kane. <laughs> I think we're supposed to be, we, we're supposed to make sure that the kids all leave in one piece, you know, yeah. collected, calm, kind of the way they came in. I don't think that's going to yeah, happen. That's out the time. window. Did, yeah. did you hear Kaner subtly mocking me? Where she go, oh, it sounds like Jenny's excited to be on your show. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah that she must was be it. <laughs> uh, more from the Vernon Hills Chamber Choir. And uh, the big story coming up next, talking about? Tax reform, but it's very, very. All right, let's get back to the music here. Jeremy Little is here in the Vernon Hills Chamber Choir. What are you going to do next? Uh, this next one is called The Holly and the Ivy. Patrick Kane insisted on it? Yeah, you know, straight from Kaner's mouth. All right, here we go. Here we go. La, 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 la.
And many more sweet Jesus Christ For to redeem us all For to redeem us all The resurrection of the sun And the running of the dear God The merry organs be singing in a choir La 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 I don't even get it. I don't know how you do that. I don't get it. I mean, the artistic uh, uh, talent here is just uh, out of this world. It really is tremendous. You should be very proud, Jeremy. Uh, we're very, I'm very blessed to work at the school and with these kids. Yeah, I, and again, to do it at this hour is crazy. Like Andy, we we're just talking about here. Andy Mazur yeah. is a tremendous photographer. Mm -hmm. So he has an artistic side. He's not just a dopey sports guy. Right. He's got an artistic side. <laughs> yeah. I do. Right? You have t t television talent. You have all sorts of stuff. I just sit here and shoot my mouth off. No. Yeah. There are a lot of talent. Yeah. Golf. Yeah. yeah. Golf. Knowledge. Yeah. Wit. Humor. Charisma. I want to be in the band. <laughs> you were in a ton of bands. Um, all right. Next song. Uh, the next song is uh, features the gals in the choir. It is called The Virgin Mary Had a Baby Boy. It is a uh, song from the island of Trinidad. Uh, and it's it's a hoot. Uh, you guys, they, the girls were very excited about this. Yeah. All right, let's see if they deliver. They were. Okay. All right, here we go. The Virgin Mary had a baby boy. The Virgin Mary had a baby boy. The Virgin Mary had a baby boy. And they said that his name was Jesus. Boy, 
the Virgin Mary had a baby boy. The Virgin Mary had a baby boy. And they said that his name was Jesus. 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 And they said that his name where our friend Ann hey, Johnson, or Ann Rambles Hall, and Kristen, and, uh, Samuelson. and Kristen Samuelson as well. Yeah. But these guys, this is the Vernon Hills Chamber Choir. Wow. I am now welcome. booking them. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I'll come back and sing one more next before we get to the Bill and Wendy experience. Hosted by who today? Do we know? Who's doing the show today? John Henson and Judy Pilak. Next. Well, almost in a few minutes on 720 WGN and CLTV. That's like perfect. now. Yeah. And right now. After the choir, you have to ask Judy what she got for Christmas yesterday. She got an early Christmas present that was very cute. Hooch? No. Oh. You can ask her after the choir. Okay. Um, all right. One more with Jeremy before we go. And actually, real quickly, all of you on the count of three, say your names and your grade point average. One, two, three. I really feel like we know them now. Me too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I feel like we're one with the choir. All right, Jeremy, take us out. What are we going to do? <laughs> All right. Thank you very much for having us. Oh, and by the way, here. thanks to Ben. Ben's the guy who plugged everything in. Made it sound great. All right. We're, we're very delighted to be here, and we'll leave you with We Wish You a Merry Christmas. I've heard of it. When you're ready. We wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Good tidings to you wherever you are, good tidings for Christmas and a Happy New Year. Now bring us some figgy pudding, now bring us some figgy pudding, now bring us some figgy pudding and bring some right here. Good tidings to you wherever you are, good tidings for Christmas and a happy new year. We won't go until we've got some, we won't go until we've got some, we won't go until we've got some, so bring some right here. Good tidings to you wherever you are. Good tidings for Christmas and a happy new year. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. All right. How about it? Let's go. Come on. You seniors, wherever you go in life, God bless you. Really fantastic. You. Juniors, sophomores, keep working. <laughs> uh, and Jeremy, I hope you bring them back next year. Uh, we'd be delighted. Thank you very much. Uh, you guys Merry are great. Christmas. Merry Christmas. Thank you so much. And happy holidays. And we'll go take some pictures in the green room. It sounds good. So, uh, Judy Pilak's here. Who's your wingman? Oh, yeah, John yeah. Hanson.